In experiment 3, an unknown acid was titrated with sodium hydroxide. To identify the unknown acid, we, we have to make a titration curve first. Here I have some random values for volume of sodium hydroxide in milliliters and the corresponding pH values at each volume of sodium hydroxide used. Select all the values first, click insert, click on the icon for scatter plots, and select scatter with smooth lines and markers. Do not forget to give the titration curve a title. So put figure one followed by a caption. Also, label your axis. To do that, select chart elements next to axis titles. Check the boxes for primary horizontal and primary vertical. And the x-axis in this case is volume of sodium hydroxide and the unit is in milliliters. The y-axis is pH. If you notice, for each increment, they are two units apart for both the uh, volume of sodium hydroxide and pH. The lab manual wants 0.2 pH unit or 0.2 milliliters for each increment, which means we ha have to add minor grid lines for this titration curve. So I'll select Add Chart Elements. Right next to grid lines, select both primary minor horizontal and primary minor vertical. So let's count how many intervals are there between those two units. One, two, three, four, five, which means each interval is 0.4 unit. Again, the manual wants 0.2 unit apart. So we have to fix this. So we'll start with the x-axis. So I'll click on the x-axis, double click, um, click again and you will see this bar graph like icon and click axis options under that for the units you can say the major is one unit apart and you can also fix the minor and uh, looks like cell automatically switch that to point two units so and and we can under access options we can select the vertical axis which allows us to fix the y-axis as well so we also want the major ax major grid lines to be only one unit apart because that's more specific and if you click on the box next to minor units you will adjust to point two units as well. So there you go. Now all the axes have major grid lines that are one unit apart and the minor grid lines that are point two unit apart.